All right, let's enter the matrix. So when we get to that exact point, I will send the signal. When I do, I want you to release the valve for about three seconds. Certainly! About time you showed up. Have you made sure the germs are sealed off? Fully sealed and filtered. Not like it matter to a dead man. You should know that Johnny's condition is deteriorating fast! This might be your last chance, you two. Whatever you do in there, good luck. Luck's the last thing we need. Enter the Digiverse! That was a short act, too. They shine their lights at other lighthouses, and at me. Let's go. No, oh, nice, it just gives you. To think that this little thing's causing us so much trouble. And I just want to kick it to outer space. I suppose all we can do now is send a signal and hope. Well, ready? Something's happening. Quick, send it again. What's going on? Doctor, something's wrong. What? Take over for me, Lily. His conditions has been destabilized and intake levels must be reconfigured. <laughs> no consistency with these characters. What's happening to this place? It's been destabilized. Get out. What? Get out of his memory, now! What are you talking about? If the system doesn't restabilize soon, the shock might permanently damage whoever's in here. You've got to be kidding me. Why aren't you getting out of here? I can't, Neil. If both of us get out under this state, all of our work will reset. There won't be enough time to redo all we've done before Johnny... Oh, you freaking... Don't pull that contrived crap on me. This ain't a movie, and you're no hero. You're just being a moron. And why are you being one, too? Get the hell out of here. Screw that. If you're gone, they'll probably pair me up with Alistair. Do you know how badly he smells? Worse than the roadkill. Damn it, Neil. This is what I get for helping you cheat for the entrance exams. I'm going to save this patient's life by typing on a computer. Doctor! I think we're okay for now. Fuck, fuck, fuck. And guess what? Your carrot cake sucks! Wait a minute. Yeah! And that last Christmas party? You... Oh. Come on, let's go before that happens again. Um... You know that I didn't mean to, you know, call you a moron, right? You know what I did, right? So, uh... How do we get there? Where am I going? Mm, touch the sucker ball. Soccer ball. Sucker ball hat. 
Except now I'm lost. There it is. Touch it. Here goes nothing. Okay, yeah, I didn't need to do that. Cool. Little toddler Johnny era. Wow, I can't believe that worked. So we actually made it. But now I'm not sure if I'm going to like this place. What do you mean? It seems peaceful enough. Neil, did you notice something odd in Johnny's room earlier? Uh, what? There was something strange in there. Did you not see it? I suppose not. Never mind. I just hope I'm wrong. What did she see? What didn't I see? What? Wow, that sounds fabulous. I know, right? You've got to take them there one day. Sheesh, the time overlap's getting out of hand. Look at how many of them are. There's like a zoo. Mm-hmm. Oh, a little Johnny and a little Johnny. Ha! <laughs> Looks like the ball's moving around on its own and he's just chasing it. Roadkill. All thanks to this little fella's sacrifice. I hope. What am I doing? Walking this way, apparently. Oh, jeez. Look at the time. I better get going. The star closes early today. Uh, take care, Martha. Say hello to the boys for me. I will. I'll see you around. Well, this is the end of the road. And you were saying? Never mind that. Maybe I was wrong after all. I mean, this place, it's so peaceful. The only thing that exists in his memory that could do such a thing would be... Shit. Duh. We need to get back, now. Wait, what's going on now? Just shut up and come. getting intense. It's getting all bassy. Skrillex. Oh. Oh. Yep. Shit. I mean, it wouldn't be very fast, but it's like perfectly head level, so it's like... And that is why the beta blockers, because he wants to forget. Or maybe he doesn't want... Maybe his mom wanted him to forget. Somebody wanted him to forget. That's his brother. I don't understand. If he was unconscious, how could we be seeing this here when he never did? Still, I'm just surprised that he survived. Actually, he didn't. What? Didn't you see in his room, Neil? Johnny slept on a bunk bed. Well, so did I. I mean, I slept in a bunk bed. I'm, I'm an only child. Joey! Johnny and Joey. Joey, can you hear me? Joey, why did you hit Joey, Mom? Why did you hit him? Joey, wake up, Joey. Wake up. That sucks. 
And now all the people come out and stare at her for being a horrible mother, and she goes and drinks her life away, and... Hmm. Joey. Even though they were young, to lose a twin brother, not to mention how their mother must feel. At last Johnny... At least Johnny had the beta blockers erase his memories. Not like he remembers it much. Fuzzily unlinked, not erased. Somewhere in there, the aftermath of those memories probably lingered. What about their mother? I don't think she took the beta blockers. She seems to have gone a little cuckoo. Yeah, probably. She killed her son, so yeah, I mean, that would do it. At least I don't really think she called Johnny Joey as a nickname. Oh, that's right, the nickname. But if she then takes Johnny for Joey, what about Johnny himself? I don't like it here. Let's move on. Seems like this wasn't the only memory unlinked. Odd, oh, it's not putting up a barrier anymore. Don't jinx it. 